Hey there, this is Diana, founder of Magnify Your Markability. I just came back from a huge networking event with hundreds of MBA professionals. I thought I would take this moment to share with you some tips on how to make a great impression at a networking event and what not to do. So five things that I observe of what people did that made a great impression were. The first was when someone actually proactively um, came to introduce themselves and were just very enthusiastic with a firm handshake. That positive energy just makes you really want to uh, connect with them on a personal level. The second was that when someone actually comes to acknowledge you or make a compliment about the work that you do, that just shows that they were well prepared and did their research. I had one particular individual who just came to introduce herself and said like, you know, I saw your videos and um, read up about the work that you do. I'm really excited to get to know you here tonight. That just made a really great lasting impression. The third is being able to be curious and ask some uh, great questions to have a meaningful dialogue there. The uh, fourth one is being able to connect with people on a personal level so that that trust is built and that um, there's that uh, uh, feeling that they want to follow up with you as well. And the last but not least is really people who are just being themselves. They're authentic, vulnerable, engaging, just comfortable with who they are. Now, on the flip side, uh, five things that um, people did that didn't really make a great impression or just, you know, weren't that memorable or maybe left questioning. The first is when people give a fishy handshake. You know, that just does not make a great first impression. That's just a sign of lack of confidence, lack of enthusiasm, just not interesting. The second one is when people just try too hard selling themselves where you, can, you just know they just want to make that pitch and sell them to you of who they are and what they have to offer and there's no questions or dialogue at all. The third are those who are just people who just stand there and don't even talk at all and you just don't even know that they exist. Uh, the fourth are those who just come and exchange business cards with you and then they go. And last but not least are those who try to impress you too much where they try to be intelligent by discussing topics that are way too complex for the event. So um, I offer you two pieces of advice uh, after a networking event of what you can do in terms of just, if you wanna stay in touch with someone, make sure you follow up within 48 hours with a personalized message. And uh, if you wanna connect with them on LinkedIn, don't forget to also add a personalized message of how you guys met, what you may have discussed, and offer to stay in touch as well. That's one of the few things you can do to help you stand out and make a great lasting impression. Cheers.